Hi Kerry, my name's Ryan from the Carphone Warehouse. Now Kerry's asked the question, what's new with the Android Platform 2.3? Well, they've added quite a few new user features to the platform. To begin with, they've changed the menu system. It's much easier to navigate. They've basically changed the design to make it much more fluent. They've also added into the menu system power control, where you can choose what parts of your device use the most power. They've also redesigned the QWERTY keyboard. It's just to make it a lot easier to use so that you make less mistakes when you're typing. The more advanced features they've added, to begin with, they've added near-field communications. Now you do require a device that has the hardware to support this feature, but what it will bring to your device is the ability to use it as a payment method. So when you go into your local news agent, and let's say for argument's sake you were to buy a newspaper, you go up to the terminal to pay, and rather than using a, your traditional bank card, you can just touch your mobile device down, and that will make a payment for you. It's future technology, but it's very, very cool. Next up, they've also added the ability to use multiple cameras. On previous Android devices, if you want to take a still photo, you could only use the rear camera on your device. That's even if you've got a forward-facing camera. That forward-facing camera was for only for video calls, but with the update of 2.3, it means you can choose which camera you use to take the still photo. There is other features coming with 2.3, and these are just a few of the main ones, and I hope it's answered your question for you, Gary.